No echo. Nice one. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I think you can climb and go up there, have a shower. Yeah. Follow in the chip shop, he said, give us six to peas with the fucking chips. The fish fryer said, you ignorant bastard. You don't order chips like that. He says, come round here, I'll show you how to order chips. Now then, may I have six to peas with the chips, please? He says, get fucked, you wouldn't serve me. <laughs> This fellow went for a job on a building site. He says, can you brew tea? He says, certainly. He says, can you drive a stack of truck? He says, why, how big is the fucking teapot? Look at this fellow went for a job on a building site. He said, uh, what's your name? He says, Paddy Mulligan. He says, how do you spell it? He says, stick the job up your arse. in a chip shop. He said, you sure this fish was cooked? He said, why? He said, that's all the fucking chips. <laughs> Pakistani watching television. He said, wear something white at night. Put a white hat on, white coat, white suit, white gloves. Fucking snowplow knocks him down. <laughs> unlucky, that, isn't it? A lot of unlucky people in this world. This fellow had no arms and no legs. He was swimming a channel, got cramp in his ears. <laughs> The unluckiest man in this world, he was drowning at sea, and this boat picked him up. It was the Titanic. <laughs> Just got washed and shaved and fucking down again. <laughs> on that back door with you, son, put the air conditioning on. Put it on number four, lengthen the wire, son. That's it. Come in, sir. Would you like a seat near the front? This way. Come this way. You can't stand at the bar, sir. Down this passageway here and over here. You, you gormless bastard. Move your fucking son. <laughs> Here you are, aren't they? Want to bring your motorbike here, you know what? <laughs> fucking dress, but looks like Sandy Man's porch, I thought. Come on, you're on it, little. It's no the other six coming, you know what? <laughs> no picking nose, look, we just swept up over there. <laughs> Put his hand down there. She's thinking to herself, piss off, you fat boss, and leave me alone. <laughs> and mate's thinking, isn't he like Johnny Osmond? A lot of people say that, I can't see that. I can't even stand on a mirror like that. <laughs> he keeps laughing. Every time you laugh, all your tits go down like that. <laughs> What's he celebrating? No school in the morning, what was he? But <laughs> them's your first teeth, them, aren't they? <laughs> You're fucking lost if you don't start laughing, I've told you. <laughs> Get them served some, get them pissed and get them out. <laughs> Fellow going, going back to Ireland, an Irishman going back to Ireland, that's a fucking change, isn't it? <laughs> Got in this taxi at Liverpool, the taxi driver says, a long journey to the airport, he said, we'll have a few riddles. He looked in the mirror, in the mirror he said, uh, brothers and sisters, have I none, but that man's father is my father's son. Who is it? The Irish fella said, uh, I don't know. He said, it's me, isn't it? 
Fuck me, he said, you're right. He got up for a trial and he says to his father, uh, I'll give you a bit of a riddle, he said. Looked in the mirror, he said, uh, brothers and sisters, have I known, but that man's father is my father's son. Who is it? His father said, how the fuck do I know? He said, you ignorant cunt. He's a taxi driver in Liverpool. <laughs> Two lesbians in Belfast fighting over rubber bully. <laughs> what about the Irish? Well, I put a French letter on backwards and went. <laughs> the shepherd having a driving test. The instructor says, can you make a U-turn? He said, make a U-turn. I'll make it fucking hard. <laughs> in Russia, Napoleon was at the head of his men. And he shouts, HALT! And this fella comes from about five miles away, the pipe staff in his arms, running up. But Napoleon was knackered when he got there. And Napoleon said, uh, What do you want? He said, I thought you wanted me. He said, I shouted, HALT! He said, Fuck me, I thought he shouted, WALT! <laughs> fella went to the doctors. He said, I can't stop scratching. He said, Drop your kicks. He said, You've got crap. He said, what's them? He said, they're very itchy. He said, I fucking know that. Can you do anything for us? On your way home, get a pound of caster sugar, rub it well in. He said, will it cure him? He said, no, rots the teeth, you'll get a good night's sleep. <laughs> Other fellow walked in, he said, I feel a bit under the weather, doctor. He said, I'll give you a full examination. He said, you've got VD. Oh. He said, must have got my lavatory seat. He said, you must have chewed it, he's in your gums. <laughs> Can't stop us laughing, can we? The only thing we've got left. My team, Manchester City, is having a rough time. Second division football now. I think the fucking Ripper will be out before we are. <laughs> Who's that ugly bastard sat next to you, love? Ah, oh, Jesus. If you get a knock off in here tonight, there's a chance for all of us, I'll tell you that. Unbelievable. Somebody's pinched the bolt out of your neck, you know. Quasi Modo went on mastermind, sat down, he said, Good evening, everybody, good evening. <laughs> Never mind all that, bollocks. What do you answer questions on? He said, uh, Masturbation, masturbation. <laughs> you can't answer questions on masturbation. He said, Well, I've started now, so I'll finish. <laughs> He's retiring, Quasi Modo. He's getting 40 years back paying a lump sum. <laughs> to Wales to Bangor. Nice guy, you know. <laughs> when the tight bosses then well, she said, there's no luck on the lab. She said, we've never had a bucket of shit pinched yet. <laughs> what kind of people talk like that? <laughs> Is this old fella gone? Has he gone? Are you all right? Was it cold in the ground this morning? So, this fella knocked a blow down with his car. The copper says, you bastard. He said, he never looked left or right. He said, he's no fucking need in his own kitchen. <laughs> fella walked in this pub and he was well pissed when he walked in. Drank eight pints of bitter, looked round the room. He says, you lot over there, a shout of bastard. You lot over there, a shout of cunts. This big Irish fella stood up and says, I'm not a bastard. He said, well, get over there with a the cup. 